Hello friends, welcome to electronics for you. In this video, I am going to explain program for the multiplication of two 8-bit numbers in ALP for 8051 microcontroller. Let us see the multiplication instruction in detail first. The instruction for multiplication of two 8-bit numbers is simply MULAB for 8051. Note here that there is no comma in between A and B. The two operands are directly written A, B and the instruction is MUL A, B itself. Here the meaning of A, B means multiply A and B that is A times B will be there and therefore we can say that this is our multiplicand and in B we are having multiplier the number to be multiplied is nothing but multiplicand and it is stored in accumulator whereas in B register multiplier is stored and the result here we are having two 8 bit numbers this is 8 bit number in accumulator another 8 bit number in the B register but a result may be of 16 bit and therefore we are having two sections one is lower byte and another one is the higher byte. So we are having lower byte and higher byte. Here lower byte is stored in accumulator automatically whereas higher byte is stored in B register and after execution you can see this and if result is greater than 255 then overflow flag will be set and carry flag is always cleared for multiplication instruction. Now remember this because we are going to use this in, in our program and here is the program for multiplication. Write an ALP for 8051 microcontroller to multiply two numbers. Assume multiplicand is stored in internal memory location 40 edge. So note the first thing the multiplicand multiplicand is at 40 edge 40 edge memory location I am writing here it like this okay and multiplier is stored at a memory location 41 edge we have to multiply these two numbers and there will be a result of 16 bit now as per our multiplication instruction the multiplicand must be stored into accumulator and multiplier must be stored into B register and MULAB will multiply this A and B and the result will be divided into two bytes that is a result will be of 16 bit here the lower byte is automatically stored into accumulator whereas higher byte is stored into B register automatically. So I am writing here likewise. Okay. Now uh, as per our program store the lower byte and higher byte of the result in memory location 42H and 43H respectively. So we have to store this lower byte at 42H as per the program requirement and higher byte at 43H ok and therefore our steps will be like this our first step here is to take this data at 40H into accumulator and our second step will be uh, data at 41H should be taken to register B now our third step is to use the multiply instruction MUL AB okay this is our third step now fourth step our result will automatically be at A and B and therefore to move this result to 42H is our next step that is step number 4 and 43H is step number 5 but here is one problem you can move the data directly from 40H into accumulator but move 
B comma 41 H type instruction is not available and therefore in this case the address of B register should be used. Now uh, go into the data sheet of 8051 where you can see the address for 8051 and it is F0 H and in case of assembly language program you should add 0 first before any character and therefore address of B register is 0 F0 H and now let us write the program for 8051. So here our first step is to take data into accumulator from 40 H therefore it is mo a comma 40 H it means that the content of 40 H is copied into accumulator okay now next step is to take content of 41 H into B register now as I have previously told we don't have uh, mo B comma 41 H and therefore we will use mo 0 app 0 that is the address of B register we are using direct addressing mode here and memory to memory transfer is used here so it is likewise that is the data at 41 H is moved to B register that is the address of B register okay and next step is to use MUL AB instruction MUL AB Okay, so it is A times B will be there and result will be stored into A and B respectively. Okay, now as lower byte is stored at accumulator, we will use again mo instruction. Okay, and mo 42H. Okay, we have to move data at 42H. Therefore, uh, in every mo instruction, at the left hand side we are having destination so 42 h comma a will be there that is the content of accumulator is moved into the 42 h that is already the lower byte okay it is a lower byte which is copied into 42 h so one task is completed now we have to move the higher byte higher byte is at the 43 h and it is from B register and therefore again I am using 0 app 0 H as the address of B register that is B register content is moved to 43 H. Now end of program in case of ALP 8051 is just like this loop here you can use any loop name and SJMP or AJMP instruction should be used then loop sjmp loop to jump itself that is nothing but end of program so in this way a multiplication program can be written and friends if you like this video please subscribe our channel and press the bell icon for notification and like comment and share thank you